But let me get uh, Eben Ada. Is the man with the numbers? Yeah, the man with the numbers. Uh, he has a way of bringing all of these things into reality with numbers. Today is October first, yeah, nineteen ninety-nine. I mean, fifty-nine years ago, yes. Nigeria gained independence. Yes. So, what, what what have we got to say? What have we got to say about that? Yeah, it's very significant. Significant. Very very. Because uh, October first is written in the Bible. Uh, according to the Bible, chapter 8, verse 5 of the book of Genesis, said on the 10th month of the first day, the top of the mountain was seen by Noah after God destroyed the earth with water. And the mountain that was seen is called Ararat, mentioned in the Bible. And you write the word Ararat into numbers, you have 59. So it's like this year, Nigeria is actually anchored. <laughs> Maybe when we become 60, we'll be arriving from the ship. To really okay, know so who we have. Now we, we have anchored right now. So, what, what does that mean? Okay, let me give you an example now. Yes. Like, uh, they said the waters that receded from the head after the flood of Noah took 150 good days to recede out of the head. Mm -hmm. But as we know, and according to the geographers, the first continent on earth was Africa. Therefore, if water covers the Africa continent and the water was receding out of Africa, it has to pass through the Valencia and River Benue down to the south, back to the ocean. Got garbage in, garbage, garbage in. That is why you have this Vanager okay. symbol. Okay. And now, they say after 40 days, Noah opened the hack and sent forth a dove who brought a green leaf. If a white dove is holding a green leaf on its beak, left will be green, right will be green. The dove will be white at the middle. So you have green, white, green now. <laughs> the now, yeah, yeah. Sometimes it's like a laughing matter because yeah, when God yeah. speaks to a human being, it's like a joke. Yeah. And Nigerians are not too spiritually inclined again. They are not materialistically inclined mm -hmm. and wealth inclined, okay. Okay, and personal blessing inclined. Mm -hmm. But they are forgotten that the tentacles of the Christian faith are well docked in particular life of nations. When God chose Israel as his chosen people, he chose Israelites to man strategic position of his prophecies at different epochs. When God chose a nation, he not choose citizens among that nationhood to man them in strategic position on his area on the world. And as we have it today, Nigeria is the chosen nation. If you go by the logo and the historical date we had as Nigerians. Nigeria got independence actually September 12th, when in Senate meeting they resolved that Today, Nigeria must be given independence. From September 12th to the end of the year, it remains 110 days. But when Jesus gave them the parable for the vice owner in Israel, he now asked those who he, 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 he was speaking with, What do you think the owner will come and do to those vice They say, He will come, take away from those wicked people, and destroy them, and give it to, them, to other people. Jesus now said, The kingdom of God, very, very, I say, today. The kingdom of God will be given to those producing this fruit thereof. Nigeria as a nation has produced these fruits. But what we have as Nigeria today is a, co is a collection of, of several ancient kingdoms and monarchies with different faith and providence. It's jump packed. But now, Israel as a nation of God was rolled down by the Roman Empire 70 AD. But 70 minutes is one hour. 10 minutes. One hour, 10 minutes ago, it's like October 1st, 1st of October. Now that independent reading. In short, you write the word independence to number. You have 110. When I say to number, A is the first letter, B is the second letter, C is the third letter, Z is the 26th letter. There's no 27 letter, or I would die today. It is 27 letters. It's 26. You write the word giant of Africa to number, you have 110. Precedent, you have 110. You write uh, independent to number 110. The first day we saw it, first day was October 1st. And we sang there, uh, we became judge of Africa. Africa, not by mistake, but by account of our law, because God said, I have spoken to the prophets. I have given them symbols and similitude. Now, I told you, similitude is like similar similarities. Okay. Israel is a nation started with 12 states. Nigeria is a nation started with 12 states. When you say 12 tribes, that's that after 12 states. Let's put it that way. You know what I mean? yeah. Jesus himself said there will be 12 kings sitting down with him at the table. Maybe it's what the mathematical team was talking about. And I'm saying, yeah. then now, 
we still have this 12 in our own tradition in Benin. The other question takes 12 days. So what I'm trying to tell say is that the arises of God on the wall of the, of the universe have not been looked upon by men because they are too materialistically inclined. Like, you cannot just have it all. Like, I woke up in the this morning, I prayed to drive there safely. The rich man that is going to stay there in Abuja is praying that there shouldn't be riots. Everybody is praying in Nigeria because of the situation. That means we have confidence of God praying in our life. If you live in America, you just tap your hand, and that will come up. You don't call God in America. Maybe, maybe, maybe you are fornicating. You say, oh, God. Maybe. No, in Nigeria, when you call God, you call him in, 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 in earnest. And people tend to forget, especially with Christians, that there is time for everything under the heavens. Fantastic. You, you, you said something about uh, the timing that we're in now. Yeah. That we Nigeria have anchor. has uh, come to anchor point now. Anchor point. Yeah. So this is not reflected in the quality of life that people are living in terms of um, absence of poverty, absence of disease, and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah I, I like that word. Uh, when you talk about poverty, are you not really mentally impoverished than food poverty? I, I still, I don't, I'm not too rich. So I throw some crumbs away. In my area, nobody really begs for food. If I really mentally impoverished, I'm wisdom impoverished. As I told you just now, even Nigeria is 59 this year. It means that we have hankered. Because if you spread the word, our rats, you have 100, uh, you have 59. And they said the 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 ship the, the hack I was talking about now had called on Martin Ararat and it was on October first. It's in the Bible. Pastor don't talk about that. Like the two white horses we have in our Bible should make us remember that those two white horses that drew the chariot of fire to heaven. And when Isaiah was writing about that, he said, "Arise and shine, for the glory of God has done all." Risen upon him. Yeah, Isaiah was actually talking about himself and other individuals that will follow suit. But arise 90 up now. You have, so you have arise 60 up, you have 90 now. But the letter I, that looks like number one, is the ninth letter. So 90, 91 is like 101. And that will be the sign of arise copper trucks. And Jesus is going to come upon a white horse. In chapter, two, in chapter, eight, chapter 6, verse 2 of the book of Revelation, he said, And I behold a white horse. And he who sat on it, had a crown, and the crown was given to him, and he went out conquering and to all conquer. From the one of independence, all our monumental strife as a nation has been grounded in prophetical ground. Well, we don't know it. Because people who do this thing do it obviously. It's only few, like let me give you an example now. When Israelite, uh, Israel, Israel was the chosen nation, but when Israel was, uh, was born, on that very day, it took three, some Eastern men that came to verify to them that the king of kings had been born. If I have not told his own prophets, go and check the books. When I really check the books, it's okay, in Judea. It's true, you know what I mean? When Eros says you want to kill children between three years down, it was fulfilling another prophecy. But you did not know God, they were not perpetual scholars again about this matter. When the Roman Empire was ruling over Israel, the common Israel would not believe that they were the chosen people because the Roman Empire memorized the world with their breastplate, organized governance, philosophy, their wine. The eloquence and the appearance ways and their chariot and their development. It took John the Baptist to know that they were the chosen people. And before John the Baptist knew this part, he arrived from ignorance to knowledge. When he became 30 years old, God gave him to the wilderness. When Jesus was 30 years old, he began his ministry. Joseph was 30 years old when he became God in Egypt. David was 30 years old when he became king in Egypt. And when you write the word ego, E A G L E. E is the fifth letter, A the first letter, G the seventh one, L the twelfth, E again the fifth. You have to have 30. Nigeria Civil War started on the sixth day of the seventh month, in the year 67. Similar date. In the year 67, on the sixth day of the seventh month, the first gunshot of the civil war took off. And it lasted for 30 months. And the Bible said, when the calf is, when the eagles will be gathered. And the way we were going to see we were like messing up, but you see how practically it is now? And a good name is better than precious ultimate. And those who God will give good names to is especially reserved. Like we we're talking on ITV station now. I just I just noticed that your Go TV station number is 107. In another independent reading, 107 is October 7th, the day Nigeria Ghana joined the nation. 
as in next next member states. And when Papa Barrow got there, he was waiting by the geographical location and the citizens. My geographical location, location always starts with three permanent digits, nine to three, before any command will go further. To tell you whether the forest is added, or the sea is added, or the lagoon is added, or whatever, but, but that 923 is constant. Your station is what? 92 went? Three. It's station in Nigeria. And 923 is like September 20, 23rd. From January 1st to that day, it is 266 days. 266 days a day is like 26th day of June, when the United Nations was formed. And I'm telling you that from that day, Nigeria generation, so from uh, 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 September, uh, so, uh, from the uh, Nigeria generation to the end of the year, we make nine days. And Nigeria became the next, next member. The highest single reason number is nine. The highest two digit reason number is 99. So you get 100. And you write the word excellent to number. You have 100. E is the first letter, S24, C the third one. E the fifth again, L L twelve twelve, E fifth, L fourteen, T twenty. You have door. You have hundred. When I was young, I used to think why double L. One L can do the job, but they put double L. Because God will hold down your feet. It's excellent. Your feet is the symbol of L. L is the twelfth letter. So Abuja became the capital territory on the twelfth day of the twelfth month. But back then, who did it like that? We for complete eight years. It was eight us man. And you write the word excellence. You have 88. It governs from, uh, from the uh, uh, Oval Office to Abuja. Oval means a head shape. Anything called Oval will hash one day. Mm. American office is still called Oval Office today. And the president is called Roosevelt. And their resolution is to vote against God. Because in their one dollar deal, you have the high of. Uh, all the, uh, the Isle of Uros is called the 13th state of the Pyramid of Giza in Egypt. You know, nothing symbol given to Baphomet. And they wrote in God with trust. The God of trust them, they didn't even hide it. It's there. To love dollar to be literally dollar. But what we have as problem in Nigeria today is that before our leaders can become our leaders, really, they are inducted into brotherhoods and fraternal clubs that makes them realize that. Actually, it's not your portion to do good again. Your ancestors do not have good name to recognize it. So how do, how do we change all of this? They put Nigeria yeah. on the path. Let us say there's stuff with heaven. It's not how do we change it. How do we get prepared for the change God wants to give to us? How do we get prepared for the change God wants to give to us? Interesting. The way we can pray for God, for, for God's changes on us is to actually dig into the providence of Nigeria as a nation. Now, America did not love America just like that. They proved that they were seven ethnic power alongside the British, so they not give Anglo-America. And there's a statement in the Bible that says, the country that does not give credence to the chosen people shall be totally annihilated. Now, in football game, if they start the ball, one player will stand this way, one player will stand the other way, then there will be a circle ball at the middle. You have one on one now. If you agree, why agree? Yeah. One always like October first. Eleven players, one goalkeeper, ten players. I want to tell you how the world has actually given credence to Nigerian nation, Duff, encoded. Like, like Nike symbol is a lot of good. When we're young, that symbol of Nike is good. When we fast, it's good. Yeah. It's good. You're going up. Yeah. You're going up. Victory, yeah. hope. Yeah. Then now they say Nigeria JC was the was the best. What they were telling the citizens of the world that in that game that year, every Nigeria city was counted by God first. Hmm. Before the Rapids started game one, the Rapids country two, the Rapids nine. But the first 12, uh, the two picks were for Nigeria. 22 players is actually one year, 10 months, October 1st. <laughs> and, um, and, and, and what you, I, I told you, you said, how can, can we change? I said, we cannot change. Yes. We only put to a basic change God wants to give to us. Okay. We must realize that the tentacles of the Christian faith is well dogged in the particular life of nations. The choosing nation and other nations that will be worrying them, or inconveniencing them, yes. distracting them. Yes. Now, if God chooses any particular nation, it's going to appoint individuals from that particular nation to fit into some particular alignment and realms in different dispositions. Jesus was born to Israel. But he consumed the glory of Israel. His ancestor, Abraham, 
brother goes to them by having faith and exercising it in God. Because without faith, you cannot please God. His ancestors got a bigger portion. His siblings got a different portion. And the first king of Israel, King Saul, was from the lowest tribe of Israel, Benjamin tribe. But when Samuel was anointed, he said, Is it because the Lord has anointed you, a uh, commander over his, his armies? Wait, 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 wait. Chapter 10, verse 1, the book of Samuel. 10, 1 is October 1st, again. again. And in Psalm 100, and, in, 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 in Psalm 110, he said, The Lord said to my Lord, Sit at my right hand side till I make your enemies your footstool. That verse was originally written for the Messiah. But the Bible that we have today, you look in this Bible, as a daily reading, prescribed for each day to be read. Because so you can read through the Bible, not in, in, in a rush, so you can meditate about it. The day the Abba Abini was crowned, the daily reading of that day included Psalm 110. Psalm 110, the first verse the Lord said to my Lord, sit at my right hand side, that I make your enemies your footstool. We all know that people actually wrongly thought that Governor Basaki lineage was any link to the Abba lineage and the making of lineage. Forgetting that Jonathan was best friend to David. Forgetting that Jonathan was best friend to David. And if Jonathan died on top of the mountain, it means that God, Jonathan was still involved in governance of Israel. But it means that David was the one chosen by God over his own family. He said, I wanted to keep David at all costs to preserve the glory for Jonathan, but Jonathan did not want it. And before the commemoration date, the Ugabe family were sitting there at all their king. Because they are from the Grizzly Dynasty too. The government took them to court on behalf of the, of the kingdom. So, in verse 2, say, Out of Zion, I shall give the earth of your power. All things is in alignment. And that verse, you see, from Messiah, we know that Messiah lived for 33 years. Everyone will be first, even for 33 years. The new about who took everyone as, as it meant to, yeah. know that you have to become a grandmaster by attaining 30 degrees in Freemason. And he's a man, but you know how it is that way. It's major main player, where they also. Okay. Now, um, let's, let's just quite to, uh, a bit distill all of this into, because I remember the starting point or the concluding part that I wanted you to focus on was on that. Um, you, said, you 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 mean, a change is coming. It's, it's well, it, it coming. It's Nigeria, and Nigeria is ready for that change. I, uh, so it, the change yes, is coming from. Uh, the, the wise one is already ready because I can't the Bible. The wise will get more wiser. Okay. The foolish will get more foolish. What we are trying to do is to wake those who are in slum, who are slumbering, mm -hmm. who are still spiritually asleep. Yes. To be alive. Like, to be alive. To change. Yes, to, to, yeah, to change. change. Positive change or negative change? Positive all round. Positive change. Yes. Like I said. Like yes. Let me give example now. Like uh, the country does not read Paris's. The day George Bush was saying this statement to the Dagati children in America, yeah. what you see that was being brought down by some of the Latin. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a big issue. Yeah. They stole a shop right. Not shop wrong, mm -hmm. not shop wrong. Yeah. Shop right. They didn't steal one fucking book. We don't use such word fucking. I mean, Sorry. Yeah, yeah, okay. Okay. They didn't steal yeah. one precious book. Mm -hmm. You get my point? Yeah. So, what I have just done now, eh? Since if a nation is destined, there must be an individual from that nation that must be there destined. So I'm choosing to write it, to write it by Nigeria destined providence. Now, so I'm using the Oba of Bini as an apex example of who God has blessed. It's very evident to be an Oba, you have to be blessed. So something you put together. Yeah, this is yes. together, right? Yes, and I'll start selling this book mm. on the day it becomes three years old on the throne. The, the providential faith of Nigeria. Of Nigeria. And Oba Ewai is second. Okay. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Thank you. It's a delight to have you. Yes. And um, happy Independence Day. Appreciate it. Congratulations. Okay. Talking with our Ben Ada, uh, he's good with the numbers and uh, everything just seems to follow sequentially. How is he able to do that? I, I really don't know. But you can, you can always give him credit and kudos. But something he said to me some time ago is that it's based on his research and uh, um, investigation just to see how these things add up and is able to bring them forward. Thank you again for coming. Appreciate it, sir. Thank you so much.